Hi, this is Ellen from The Good Life. Guess what I purchased? A uh, Burnett for my ideas. B44 Funlock. Now, this is a Burana, Bur Nina, but Burnett is majority steel and plastic. The Burinas are all steel, which is a lot of money. So, I got this one. They were nice enough at the um shop to thread it for me. That was great. And I practiced on it. And I decided to get the Serger Essentials. This is a book right here which tells you everything you need to do to make certain projects or to sew. And it tells you what press of foot to use which yeah all the stitches and stuff which is really nice I was shocked so they told me this is a better book see getting to know your serger serger stitch the cover stitch and all that I don't have a cover stitch but I have this it is a 432 that means four um threads Overlock stitch, three to seven meters. Roll hem stitch, 1.5. High sewing period, 1,300 per minute. Differential feed, you always need a differential feed. Easy color coding thread, accessory storage and looper cover, manual needle threader, cuts off being included, LED illumination. And this is what comes with it. Also, you have your four um, thread seals. If you use the small, small ones, you have a screwdriver and you have a, a, an extra knife. And then you have these to put on the smaller thread. And then you have the oil. And that's nice. So this is what comes in. Then I went ahead and I purchased the extra feet. Bernadette B44, B48, and also B64. Press a foot, and these are all the press a foot, and I got an extra spring right here. So the press a foot is right here, right there. A robin, caution foot, elasticator foot, blast dish foot, piping foot, beating and sequin foot, and gathering foot. That is amazing. They right here. And they tell you what page, the instructions. And this also, it will tell you how to set your serger up. Right here. And then, here she goes. This is the back of it. Right here. So, this is orange, navy, green, and tan. This is supposed to be red, and this is supposed to be yellow. But I, I got the orange, and I wanted a tan, a neutral. This right here is a dial. Dials and stuff like that. The tension is right there. And where to put it, it already came set. I can do zigzag Z and you turn it on right here. Right there. This is the power cord and you got a footer. This is the measurements. If you want um, half, five eighths, 1.5, 1 and 2.5. 
And the and this already came um tension four four four. That's the tension. That just for a straight overlock. Then this is the waistband. The waistband for the fabric. Take that out. And you slide this over and come down right here. So I got the tweezers, the extra needles. This is an extra knife, cutting knife. The um, threader, the needle threader. This another, the, the brush, the cleaner. Yep. And that's it. Yeah. And this is another tool right here that I can adjust two right there and this how it's threaded and you follow the diagram to thread it right there so when you get it the machine is already thread it will be white thread and you lift it up and you're supposed to tie your particular colors onto it but the lady at the shop made a mistake and cut the whole thing so she had to re-thread it so then when your thread get ready to end just tie a knot with the replacement thread so you don't have to worry about going through all this diagram close it and spring it down put this up here right here in the swiss mix design and these are the stitches i made myself a little pocket today this is it this these are the stitches right here yep you have to be on the same um footing like um when you're doing the speed you have to be in the same footing so it's really 13 um uh, strokes per minute and you want it be there so it won't um uh, if you do it too slow it will bubble up like this but you but it's, that's fine then i flip it back and i made my first pocket but by practicing look this is my first pocket right here look at that my first pocket Yep. And this is knit. This is my um, spare, you know, my str scraps. That's knit. And this is it. And this right here, you to um, bring up the presser foot, you got to go down, which is different because I'm used to going. You got to bring down. Then to bring it down, you got to go up. That's kind of confusing. And stuff. Yep. So. This is her. Bernadette. So. I will be. This right here. Is new, is neutral. But if you want. Zigzag. And a long Z. Long Z. I can put that on there. And this right here. It goes. I don't even. Yep. This right here. Is the needle go up and down. And this right here is also the tension and the right here. And you see this right is the neutral. It stays in end neutral. But if I want to roll in him, I move this back to this. The roll in him. Then I take out one of those. Um, I take out the first. Um, no, the second needle because this was the second needle to do a roll him. So this is going to be amazing. Then I just bring this down when you through and put these in in the cone head space and then turn it off and put the cover on it. It's designed for everything. It covers everything, everything up. See, right here. It covers everything up. 
I'm just, so I had space on my sewing table. And this is my sewing table. I had space. One day I'll show you my sewing room. And thank you for um, listening. Give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. And have a nice evening. Bye.